so many almonds today. Hallelujah. Ready to commit suicide. Hallelujah. Oh Lord, we cry out for the thrones in the valley of the sea. Hallelujah. 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 Keep crying out. Keep crying out. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah.
It's thick in here. It's thick in here. Whatever you want, you should have got it already. It's thick in here. Hallelujah. I want to give honor to the Pastor Keys. And everybody whom honor is due, I thank God for my own companion. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I thank God for those that came that I invited. Oh, I tell you. Woo. I don't know where I'm just I'm telling you, y'all. If you all didn't get it, I, I don't know what to say. It's so thick in here. He here. If you want the Holy Ghost, he here. All you got to do is open up and say, here I am, God. I'm sorry, God. Forgive me, God. Feel me, God. I tell you what, these women have been pulling on God. Amen. You can see it. Huh? You don't come by this overnight. This being persistent and consistent in the God's face. This is where this comes from. Woo. I don't know about y'all, but I stepped in. And I got mine. Amen. Amen. Now, I'm not going to be before you long because God has done that thing. Amen. But I hope this is a crowd. I'm sure it is because God wouldn't have gave me this message if this wasn't a crowd that was so self-righteous that they couldn't receive what I'm saying. But he told me to make it simple, make it plain, and I could be myself tonight. Can I be myself? I just want to be myself tonight. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You know, I... We get so used to using those Bibles on our phone. Uh, I'm guilty. Until I could not lay hands on my physical. When I preach, I like to have my physical Bible. I couldn't lay my hands on it. I don't know where I would put it at. Because uh, I got I got my 10 different Bibles on my phone where I can jump between whatever, dictionaries, whatever. Uh, technology good though. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. We're going to go ahead and go to the Word. Amen. Hallelujah. I thank y'all. I found it an honor that you all invited me. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Uh, Pastor Keith had invited me when it was just about, I don't know if the coronavirus was just kicking in, or mm -hmm. uh, just getting started, but I couldn't come. But I tell you, when that thing let up, I got to get the running, y'all. I got to make up. I got to make up time. Huh? I got to make up for the time out of loss. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I want to use for a topic tonight. God don't want to be your sugar daddy. Amen. Hallelujah, Jesus. Draw my subtopic. We're going to go to James 4 and 8. Holy Ghost, help me. James 4 and 8, if y'all got to say amen. Amen. Yeah, hallelujah. James 4 and they say, draw nigh to God, and he will draw nigh to you. Cleanse your hands, ye sinner, and purify your hearts, ye double minded. And the message of Bible, just to make it just a little bit more plain, but just in case y'all didn't understand. Say a quiet yes to God. And he'll be there in no time. Quit dabbing and sin. Purify your inner life. Oh, I'm not talking about that outer life. See, y'all got for food with that outer life. Huh? But you can't fool God. He said, purify your inner life. Quit playing the field. I'm going to focus right there for just a minute. Quit playing the field. You know, uh, uh, they have this thing. I don't know if they do it now or. But then, when, when I was coming along. When I wasn't doing what I was supposed to do. Amen. They had this thing where, you know, we're going to talk about three different types of men. Okay? When, you know, this girlfriend, she had a main man. Uh, see, I'm going to make a plan to y'all. She had a main man. 
See how main man worked hard? He treated her right most of the time. Uh-huh. And, and, and she even thought that he was good enough to marry. He was a little self enough to marry. But guess what? He didn't want to marry her. He wasn't ready to get married. Oh, I'm talking about a main man now. And so for fear of putting her eggs in all one basket, huh? Just waiting on this. She decided to go get her side man. Let's talk about this side man. Yeah, that side piece. Come on. Say they call it a side piece. Uh-huh. I think somebody know what I'm talking about. All right, but well done. And you all that side piece. Now see that side piece, he look good. He smell good. He talk good. Oh, that's on the side piece now. Uh-huh. And he can make you feel good. Huh? But he was broke. Huh? That side piece was broke. Hallelujah, Jesus. He had too many ain't got. Y'all understand what I'm talking about? He had too many. Yeah, I'm talking about the side yeah, on, He ain't got no J O B, no H O M E, huh? Yeah. No, and no M O E Y. Yeah. He had too many ain't got. Yeah. Oh, but that yeah. side piece made you feel good. Yeah. Hallelujah! I'm hoping I'm helping somebody already. Yeah. Hallelujah! Thank you, Lord Jesus. And then the bad thing about them side pieces, most of the time they ain't got no car. Yeah. Uh, they drive in your car. Yeah. Coming to pick you up from your job. Huh? And then sometimes they late. Uh -huh. I'm talking that side piece. Yeah. Ain't worth the hill of beans. Yeah. But you love how he make you feel. Yeah. Now he know how to put all the right words in the right places. No. So he got you caught up. But your mind's still on the main piece because you know the main piece. He halfway treat you right. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. But because that side piece can't supply what you need. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. You move on to the sugar daddy. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. See that sugar daddy. The thing about him is he may be middle aged. Mm -hmm. He may be old, but he's several most of the time he's several years older than you yeah. are. Yeah. Yeah. Holly, that, 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 yeah. that sugar daddy. Yeah, yeah. He look good most of the time. Yeah. He smell good too. Yeah, he, he driving fine cars. Uh -huh. Got a home. Yeah. Established. Yeah. Got money. Yeah. And a wife. Come on, talk about a sugar daddy. Uh -huh. Am I telling the truth? Am I telling the truth? Yeah. Yeah, you Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. And see that sugar daddy. He don't make you feel good. Right. See, I'm finna make a play. A lot of times you have to fake it with the sugar daddy. All right. Because you want that money. Yeah. Hallelujah. You want what he can do for you. That's right. Real. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Have your wake up. And then, and, and, and I think about when you're with that sugar daddy, after you done taken care of him, you, you go get the most fake tears and, and go to crying to him. And, uh, daddy, I'm telling you, I'm seen it, y'all. My, 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 my rent due. Daddy, my car no due. Daddy, they talking about putting me out of my home. Daddy, they finna come pick up my car. Right. Him with his chest all stuck out. Yeah. What you need from daddy? Yeah. Huh? And daddy take care of that need. Yeah. But you're still lonely. Yeah. Even with the main man. Yeah. You're still lonely. Yeah. With the side piece. Yeah. You're still lonely. Yeah. Huh? With the sugar daddy. And some of us want to treat God like he our sugar daddy. Yeah. You got your hands out. surrender give old to him. Yeah. yeah, God, I, I got a saying. I put the pattern down. Keep getting saved till you get saved. Yeah. I want you to continue to get, keep getting saved till you get saved. Yeah. But I'm going to talk real to you tonight. Yeah. Hallelujah, Jesus. God wants us to give it to him. Yeah. We've been battling and struggling with things. Yeah. And he wants to give you total deliverance. Yeah. 
can't use you like he want to because you won't give him your whole heart. See, you can't serve two masters. You're going to love the one or hate the other, but you got to make up your mind. Glory, 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 glory. Live or die. I'm sick and tired of me, God. Move me out the way, God. I'm tired, God. I'm tired of failing you. I'm tired of letting you down. More than anything myself, oh God. Here I am, God. Get out, help me get out your way, God. So you can have your way, Lord Jesus. Go to the whole shot, God. See, we want to make him out of sugar, Dad. But God told me to tell you, He don't want to be your sugar daddy. He want to be your main man. So He'll treat you better than the main man. Uh, it won't be some time, it'll be all time. And see, I'll tell you, see, see, He got characteristics, really, of all three men. See, that main man, God want to be the main man because He'll take care of you. He don't want to, a real man don't want to share you with nobody. That's right. Huh? He, he, he want to be the, the center of your life. He want to be the center. He want your attention. He don't want you talking that other me. Huh? Hallelujah, wishing. Mm, he show sure looking good. He don't want that. That main man want to be your main squeeze. And when he really loves you, he'll take care of you. See, God, he want to be your main man. He'll take care of you. And see, Characteristics of, of, of that side piece. What I mean by that is, he'll make you feel good. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. And when he make you feel good, you don't have to worry about when you come. You know, you coming in the club and you come home in the morning. You got a hangover for what you done did all night yeah. long. Yeah. You got guilt for what you done did all night long. But the thing about God, Hallelujah, Jesus. He'll make you feel good. And you won't have no hangover. He'll make you feel good. Hallelujah. He'll take the aches out your body. He'll heal your soul. Yeah, Lord. He'll take you to a place in him that you never imagined. A peace beyond your understanding. A joy that'll flood your soul. He'll take away that fear of the world. He'll take away that feeling of doubt. He'll break them yokes and break them chains. Oh, God. He'll, he'll deliver you so to you make you open up your mouth. And tell your neighbor where he brought you from. Now, God also has the characteristics of the sugar daddy. Uh, he's a need supplier. He's a way maker. Why are you trying to get another man to do it? Let God. Yeah. See, only thing he expect from you is some praise. Yeah. Only thing he expect from you is some hallelujah. Only he thing he expect you is some obedience. Yeah. Only thing he expect. But I'm gonna tell you about that sugar daddy. When he gives you that money, he wants the honey, and he ain't gonna let you get away with it. You might tell him, "Go, go, hallelujah! I got saved now. I can't do that no more." If you can't do that no more, you can't get my money no more. I got to find somebody. See, that's the attitude to go ahead. I got to find somebody that's willing to take this money and do what I want them to do. Go run over a shot. God don't want to be your sugar daddy. We treat him like that because we always in his face with our hand out. Uh huh. Lord, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. And last night we've been in jest. Did what he told us not to do. No, no, We've been in jest. Yes. Let old glow Johnny in the back door. Let him in, let, let him in the back door and praying at six o'clock in the morning on the prayer line. Hey, God. But give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Sugar daddy. You're trying to treat him like any old thing. But he said it's going to be all or nothing. I want to be your main man. I want to be your way out. I want to be your way over. I want to be your way through. I want to be your provider. Hey, God. Let me be God in your life. Put on a you, you, you say God is a healer. You, 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 you say he's a deliverer. You say he can do all this. But your lifestyle. But your lifestyle says different. What you do and people see, it says different. Go to the most He ain't going to be your side piece. And he ain't going to be your 
sugar daddy. See, if life haven't happened to you, knock, knock is coming. If you haven't got yourself together, if you got any inkling of God, Right. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. 
yeah. turned his mind yeah. with him and can't beat that bitter seed. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. A second one benefit that he got. See, a lot of times when we come to it, we tired, we woke down, looking homeless, huh? Struggling. I'm going to say it like struggling and strength. Huh? Coming to it. Glory, hallelujah. But the thing, and, and he's strung out on drugs. And you know, can't nothing take your look like crack and mess. Huh? It, it, it takes you to the lowest of love. You do things you wouldn't dream of. That's right. You look in vain. But the benefit of God, he said he'll beautify that company with salvation. He'll turn back the hands of time. He'll put that weight back on. Straighten that skin tone out. Beautify you. People know that you change. What did you do? I want what you got. Where do you be? Said, Come unto me, all you that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest unto your soul. After he beautified you, glory, hallelujah. See, some of you have been out there so long, glory, hallelujah, have been out there so long. I don't know about y'all, but when I came in, I was tired. Yeah, come on. I was sick and tired of being tired. Yes, Lord. I was tired. See, I wasn't strung out on drugs. I don't think I was. I was doing a few drugs, but I was the drug dealer. See what I'm saying? I was the pistol whooper. See, I, I know I don't look like what I've been through, but I was tired of that life. Yeah. I was tired. And I kept dreaming that they were taking my children. I was just tired. Oh, God. I had tried everything else. You go to the old shot. Looking for love in all the wrong places. Hallelujah, Jesus. But when I get sick and tired of being sick and tired, I came. As I was. See, the thing about the scripture said, if you draw nigh to him, he'll draw nigh to you. I think about when I was growing up and my mother friend would come over to visit. See, the older folks don't know exactly what I'm talking about. But when they get ready to leave, glory, hallelujah, they would say, guys, my mother would say, I'm going to walk you a piece of the way home. And she would walk a piece of the way home, halfway home. And when she got halfway home, they were still talking. She would turn around, they would walk back to my mother's house. And then after they talked a little while there, they would walk back halfway, piece of the way home. God said, you draw not of me. I'll draw not of you. All you got to do is flinch like you want to come to me. All you got to do is do piece of the way. I'll meet you where you at. Hallelujah, Jesus. I felt like a man got his own dirty. But he met me piece of the way. And he took me all the way. God don't have to do nothing. When you meet you, he ain't meet you for nothing. Hallelujah, Jesus. Peace of the way. I'm so glad he met me peace of the way. All I see, I, I tell you. I have been praying, Lord, save my son. Save my son. My son struggling out on drugs real bad. He looking bad. He homeless. He called me and talked about killing me. You know, glory, hallelujah. I said, Lord, save my son. Save my son. Save my son. You saved me. You came and got me. Oh, God. You came and got me out the book of the mouth. Get my son, God. And the Lord spoke to me. He said, I can't save nobody. They wanna, don't want to be saved. And then he explained to me what he meant. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Some people you have strung out on drugs. They really don't want to be there. They really don't want to be strung out. They want to build a life. They hate where they at. But my son told me I love getting high. And he told me, it ain't the drugs falls I'm here. It's everybody else's fault. It's money y'all the store for me. So you got to want to be saved. I don't care where you're at. You got to want God. He ain't going to force himself on you. But if you just flinch 
Amen. 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 The one thing about God, he'll tell you to stay close. And the closer you stay with him, the more your spiritual ear open. He'll say, don't go in the job today. He'll say, oh, hallelujah, don't go to the lunchroom today. You know, he might not tell you what's going to happen, but you stay out the lunchroom. And come to find out so much went on in the lunchroom. The people lost their job. Little small things like that. He'll tell you, don't take this freeway, go to bank. You got a bad car wreck on the freeway when you stink. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Lonely. He'll tell you stay close. We'll blow your Johnny Holly at you. And he ain't the one. He'll say stay close. He ain't the one. He ain't the one. Hallelujah. Stay close. He don't want to be distributed. He don't want to be your part-time lover. Uh, he want to be your main name. Yeah. Your main squeeze. Uh-huh, the one you love. Most of the time, the main one, man, is the one you love. <laughs> really love, but you can't just get him to do right. <laughs> but in order to do good, God, get God to do right, all you got to do is do right. You tie God's hands up when you walk in on business. I ain't saying every day going to be no better roses. Someday you're going to drink tears for one. Huh? Hallelujah. You all, I, I, I'm, I'm just about finished. I want to say this, because I never want to preach, teach, whatever y'all want to call it. You can call me a reacher, and you take the R for reaches each. Then let me reach each and every one. I don't care what you call me. Just don't stop me from talking about my God. Amen. Hallelujah. You might be a little quiet. I like to tune up a little bit. So when the Holy Ghost hit me in the back, and I see Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. See, when he go to making it feel good. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. When you got good news, feel good news. You can't help but tell somebody what he did for me. What he doing for me. God can fix it so you all, even in the midst of your struggles and your trials, you will be able to go through with joy in your heart. Peace in your mind. You'll mount up the wings as an eagle. Fly above the storm. I know what I'm talking about. See, I don't like to give, talk, preach without telling this. Y'all know I was, you might not know some of y'all know. I was in a car wreck in 98. And in that car wreck, I lost my 8-year-old, my 10-year-old, my sister lost a 12-year-old, a 13-year-old. We were only way to bury my mother. Stepfather was driving, he passed away. They had the four coffin friends, five coffin funerals. My kids on one side, my sister's kids on the other side. That's my sister right there. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. But God brought us through. Amen. Hallelujah. I had a broken femur. My pelvis bone was broken. My back was broken two places. My shoulders, wrists, and ribs. And they said, this time you may never walk again. But I told them, you all do all you can do. And God's going to do the rest. See, sometimes I just take our walk and just call the king. Okay. You got to understand. Hallelujah. This feels good, y'all. Hallelujah. He kept my heart. See, I ain't just now starting to pray. I was flat on my back and I was in my living room. People were coming in and out of my home. I would lay hands on them. They were hitting the floor and the Lord was filling them with the Holy Ghost. See, I didn't just start this prayer. I prayed them in the middle of the storm. Hallelujah, Jesus. He called He's a good, good, good God. I don't want to be. Your sugar daddy. It's time out. Amen. I want to be your man. I want to be the one that comforts you. I want to be the one that take care of you. I want to be the one you talk to and tell your emptiness, most thoughts, and desires. I want to be the one. I want to be the one you depend on. I want to be the one you rest in. See, he over here. He'll God come in and change your soul to you look rested. Uh, you don't even look tired no more. You look rested. Hallelujah. But it takes staying close. 
Let him meet you where you at and taking you the rest of the way home. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Let's get y'all. I feel the Holy Ghost lifting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And ain't no sense in going no more. Right. Hallelujah. 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 H